Right, long ass. In the same way, a nose can be multifaceted, I guess. Uh oh, peg. The what? So we have to start this one over because my internet became she died. Close the gate behind her if she could. The day of yesterday. A feather from the healer's dress. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bunch of assholes down there. <laughs> Multifaceted, I believe. Murder this guy, cha cha cha. Wait, what? This stone skin doesn't give a shit about this. Bit glad you see the music. It's from Eye of Argon. A man that's not too sure about words. Right, take the knock. Eat ass, Wazuk. It's one of those things, eggs lay eggs thing. Danger, Roy Orbinson. Oh, I'm an oida. No. Fucking it, uh, I thought I invented an ability, that guy. Get shot the student, yeah. Damn it. Ish. 
Nice. Ah, il faut comme. Man, I just fucking hate that guy. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's hard to be a nice man. Well, it's hard to be a boogaloo. I'm a channel man. Then. I found you. My of course. Yes. Blah blah. We saw this yesterday. My internet became died mid ass. Yes, obscure game. It's not Minecraft. <sighs> Whatever it is, kids play. These guys are hanging out together, what the fuck? <laughs> Burn it flame. Bastard. Heal sucks. Oh, he has heal as well now. Hmm. 
Die. They have made a lot of other stuff. For what you've done. Will you, witch girl? <laughs> we have seen you sneaking in those temples. You have one of those pieces in your chest. It hurt going in. Was it you who took my shard from the Foxwood Temple? That's right. And you must be the ones who beat us to it at the Furrowfells. A small girl and a bearded warrior, the report said. You really made an impression, I won't deny it. Where's the shard you took? Tell me, now. Marshal Coco has it. You'll get another one from your chest. I want you to tell me if it hurts more coming out. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't expect to just find this fucker in, in Asgarden. Only say lol. Man's not having a good time. <laughs> Eat shit, ag sack. Look at him going apes, but... Master the temple automatons and failed, yet they submit to you. Spare me my life, I plead you. I want to serve you. You destroyed my home, my family. I won't let you live. I can help you. I can tell you where Coco is stationed with his iron bear and the shard. My Blossom, please quench your fury but a moment. The shard held now by Coco can yet be yours. All I did was follow orders, my queen. Orders from Coco and Louis. Was I not a slave? And 
a victim when my own village was invaded and those who did not submit to Loey were lined up and crushed. I was younger than you. I can help you on your way to conquest and revenge. Talk. Not far from here, to just a stone's throw inland from the beach on Lake Alway, there's a farmstead, Und Harmo Grange. Oh, there it was. That's where Kokong's camp is. He is preparing to strike camp soon, but he expects my troops to join him and will wait for us. Not for long, you understand, my queen, but if we don't waste time, we should be able to reach him. Und Hamo Grange. That's not far. It's on the north shore of the lake, right? Yes. There are some four platoons of mechanized infantry and archers there, with exoskeleton support and engineers. The fortifications are temporary, but quite strong. And, of course, Koko has his iron Ugata, the great bear. Hmm. All right. You've given me valuable information. I won't kill you. Oh, thank you, my gracious queen. Hear me, Northland men! Did you hear the words of your so-called leader? The way he betrayed you? Um, my queen, no! D don't kill me! <laughs> He says, super dead. Possibly the deadest man Another in feather. the game. She's left me. Damn it, man. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Never really understood why we always have to go back to us when the map usually is just empty. Kaipune. Radios. Deadest man. Why Are is he not dead? For the healer's cabin? That's right. I need to talk to her about what we do next. Well, would you um say I'm happy she's back? Of course. My blossom, my kipuna, my finder when I was lost. Don't mention it. Look. We've been to all the temples and feel marked on the map. Yet we haven't recovered every shard. That's right. This Marshal Koko, Lemekin's old friend, he's got one, and we need to get it before Lohi does. But I've got to tell the men. Like a queen. Don't say that. Don't. I don't want to be a ruler. Even if I could, I wouldn't want to. Angsu only made that up to save himself. Groveling before tyrants was all he knew. Toppy and Lemekin are but two men, but your men now, nevertheless. Fill them with confidence, with fervor to follow you as a true queen. Listen up, both of you. All right. Let's hear it. I killed Angsu, but his master, Koko? Is mine. Well, I'm happy you still feel that way about it because he's got one of the shards, and he's taking it up to the Northland. So, I've got to catch him before he gets there. And I could use some help. Finally! Your time's up, Goko! 
Ha! I'll hang your head from the prow of this boat. All right, so that's what we do. The mission's still on. Yes, but we'll make a small detour on the way. What? Where? Home. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Home for the DK. Home DK for the DK. Dot for Dot Earth. My blossom, upon what sullen shore your bark has found its way? Can we talk? We're here now, and. I'm going to see my home again, but I'm not sure why I wanted to. My seafarer, my spark. You seek counsel, thinking I will know the course to follow, or can encourage you upon the one you've set. Well, can you? It is not your meek healer you must ask, Kipuna, but the one who's guided us both. The spirit of the Aurelith. I'm not sure I know how. Go forth and find the blessed pit where you were first chosen for your task. There, you will find it easy. Wait. Oh, I see. Well, here we are. Looks like many of the houses are still standing. I expected it would have burnt everything. Still, not a place for people to live in anymore. You're right. This won't take long. We had a chest full of armor piercing arrowheads at the castle. I'm gonna see if I can scrounge up some for Limiken. All right. I'll help you look. This is it. Home. It's not too bad. Foundations are still strong. Looks like most of the walls could be salvaged. A skilled carpenter and a couple of laborers could rebuild it in a few days. Plenty of timber to be had. I don't suppose it took that long to build in the first place. It's hardly a mansion after all. Just well, a cottage like the rest of them. Trapdoors. I guess. Houses don't last forever anyway. Have to rebuild them eventually. But why? Who would move here? When we get the Aurelith to Anthea and they build the protective shield around Kalavala, this little town will still be out here for Lohi to raid or burn or whatever it is she wants with it. There's no hope here. I didn't come here to rebuild, just for goodbyes. What now she's gonna give the the shard to him? Again, what the fuck? Look at this. Logs and planks laid along the broken bridge. By the Northlanders? I doubt it. They make use of spruce logs in standard sizes, bound with iron hoops to keep them from splitting. No, no, this was done by survivors. You think there's still someone living here? Someone who's got away? Possibly. But not likely. I see no smoke from fires. And who would live here without lighting one? It's cold. I think you're right. Whoever stayed here long enough to lay the logs must have thought better of it once the snows came. The grain stores looted, Northlanders still about, Caius crawling out of the woods. <sighs> Let's just hope they made it safely to Kalavala. Maybe it was me that did that all along. Um, arrowhead books. No use going up the ramp. The gate on this side's collapsed completely. Right. We'll have to see if we can make it to the other gate. Oi, oi. I think a stock on a curse up there. Mm-hmm. I thought of these walls as unbreakable, that they would. Yeah. Oops. Well, we're going to get in for that soon. 
Okay, look for a box of arrowheads. About waist high. I'm on it. All right, I got the special arrowheads. That's great. Let's get a move on. No use standing around here freezing our things off. <laughs> yeah. Getting a move on does not involve running, though. Fulcum. the door but he's kept well I guess it's been cold hard to believe we were living on top of a predecessor temple all along what else might there be waiting on the ground like You ever think about that? I guess I've seen enough of the temples now that they don't feel all that mysterious anymore. Just, just old places underground. Mm. Well, let's go have a look at this first one then. Actually, if you wouldn't mind, I'd prefer to be alone here for a moment. Sure, that's fine. No problem. I'll just go on ahead. Don't stand around too long, though. We'll catch you cold. Jipuna, uh -huh. my child. The circuit is about to close. You've done well, my human conduit. My living copper wire. Thank you, whatever you are. But please don't call me a child. I wasn't one when I set out. I'm certainly not one now. No, though you are human, and it's much the same. I've collected all but one shard. I'm going to get the last one soon. If I make it, it's over? I'll be finished? If you wish. Add the shard that remains in the hands of the enemy to my constellation first. Then, relinquish the one embedded in your breast and complete my form. That will in turn permit the healer to mend your wound. We shall both be whole then, you and I, though separate. My magic shall no longer flow through your body, but your own life force shall. Once more. What about your warning? What if Anthea uses your power for evil? Neither my past masters, nor any generation of men to come, shall be at peace. The fate of your race is wrath and bloodshed. Surely the war between Kalevala and Lohi's legions shall end in the victory of one and the ruin of the other. It shall not be the last such war. I understand. I'm ready. What do you mean, Ono? My basket molten hog. Please do a term it Christaten. Christaten. Crystal Satan. Christate. Oh, it's a crab. I figured it out. The 
the fucking throne god. ready to go now and you've spoken to the source and heard her in turn yes listen I I've come to a decision I'm not going to go through with it dear flame ripe bloom you shall not turn away so close to the end the last of the shards looms ahead but a swift step from your grasp no I'll get the final shard I'll do it but afterwards I that is all that matters when the parts of the Aurelith are reunited, surely all will be made clear. You will know then what must be done. I know it now. I've got to tell the men. So, are you ready to start for the enemy camp? First of all, I want you both to know how grateful I am for your help and protection. I never would have survived this far without you two. Thank you. I'm proud of it. Soon we can go back and tell Lord Antheor, mission accomplished. Only that's not what you're planning to do, is it, Kipuna? Our mission still stands. We're hitting the camp to get the final shard, but after that, we're not going to Kalavala. Once I have the entire Aurelif with all its power available to me, I'm taking the war to Lohi. You're planning to sail to the north, then? Utter madness. What about Lord Anthea's orders? It's treason to disobey. Anthea, he has his hands full defending the capital, and I trust he's suited for that. With Ilmarin's dome powered by the Aurelith, the city of Kalavala might well be impregnable. But there are a hundred towns like this one, all vulnerable. If Anthea hides behind the dome, what about the rest of the land? Lohi will overrun it, burning and enslaving. No, Anthea has commanded that we bring the Aurelith to him. I know. But the shard was given to me, not to him. For what? To what end? I alone have to make that decision. Antheor's plan is wrong, and I don't trust him to see reason. But with the Aurelis full power, I can destroy Lohi and end the war, not prolong it at an unbearable cost. That's what I'll do. I'm a Calabalan soldier, one of Antheor's men, to the death. I'll stay with you up until you've got the final shard. As far as I'm concerned, you haven't stopped following his orders yet. So, I'll follow mine. I can ask for nothing more. And I am grateful for that much. Fools! You're as likely to survive as a man who's been hacked to pieces and thrown in a river. Maybe so. I'm sorry to have to say goodbye to you, Lemmikin. But I expected as much. Just get me to Kulku. After that, you're on your own. Good. To Coca's camp, and then the final shard. <laughs> the boat's going up and down in the water, but he isn't. Whee. Yes. Oh no! Get in the boat! Oh fuck. Oh, yeah, yeah. Here you go, bin bear guy. I'm an oil. Dumbass, and oh, yeah. All right, range. Nice. 
Man's very angry at this coco mambo. Oh yeah. Fucking sauna. What a guy. Fucking lol. Three new idiots show up in the ass. Yeah, fuck that wall. Mm, fuck him, it. Man's what we DK call a limb slapper. A limpy deshka. Lol. Cha.
I guess this thing is called deflect arrow because block, even though it does the same, also deflects attacks. <laughs> well done, Pemmican. Hardosters. <laughs> no. We've got to find a way to break that gate. Well damn that thing fucks. Angriest turret in the game. Last for almost the entire duration of the ass. What if it's actually hitting whatever it's trying to ask? I think so, maybe. Some, some other ass is certainly angry. Shoot the big man, go down. Yes. Oh no. Kaiser, as they say. This is the main gate. The best defended part of the camp. There must be an easier way inside. Makes weird swine noises.
Oh, that's him. I didn't realize it. <laughs> Every dog town. Finally, Kuko and his damn machine. It's time to end it. How are we supposed to bring that thing down? Shoot it with arrows. We'll come up with something. We're not going to turn around now. You're right. Destroy the iron and bungalows. Why is Snadly Darius? He's immune to that, never mind. Bjorn. Oh, right, score, that's one of those though. Oh, he's half dead already. <laughs> As they say in anime, I blow ass. Darn it. Damn it. Weird ass bear. Bjorn.
No. Bald so einmal. Managed to bring one of the automatons out of the temple in working condition. Oh, up on in then, girl. That'll sure come in handy against Goku's beast. I'll cover you. Yeah, I got the online today. No, don't punch it. I like how it oogles. Sell down, Beavis. What a fucking donger. <laughs> fucking honestly. What? I thought I stone skinned them. Alright, I guess I can't. Why didn't that work? Oh, wrong ability. Oog. <laughs> Fuck you and your iron and boongus. The most thing that just happens to turn. Stupid bear. Cannot hide forever. Hmm. 
Moment of toot. Fine. I'll finish you with my own two hands. I'm taking your head today, Coco. You traitor! Wait. Let me Ken. You scruffy little rascal. Have you come to join my forces? Well, if so, that was a hell of an application. I'll make you my right hand man. I'll make you suffer. I won't kill you quick, you bastard. I'll draw it out before I let you die. Stop shouting, Lemmikin, and let's kill him. He's the one who destroyed my hometown. Dah, you always were a sniveling spoil sport. And I see you've found a companion who's just the same. So, come at me and see if you can't show me how to die with honor. Hey, the, the kind of mate that's like that. Who are... The fuck is he? <laughs> he does the old scoot. You fight well. Mambo. I'm giving you another chance. The glorious Northland army could use you both. Give us the shard right now, and we'll let you live and skulk back to your queen. The girl doesn't speak for me, Kukul. Shard or no shard, you die today. On second thought, I doubt I could stand your squealing and bickering for long. Best for all of us that I crush you underfoot. Yes, the anus. Curse you, Lemmikin, and your fire witch. I'll see you in the underworld, and when I do, um, uh. he was tough. Yeah, the toughest of us. Now I'm the only one left. Only me. Are you... Wait. Are you crying? Watch it. Right. That was silly of me. So your tribe is avenged now, right? Is that how it works? I don't know. I never thought much past this moment. Maybe when I make it to the underworld, someone will tell me. Maybe Goku will. Under this is gummies. Oh. To the north we go, Kipuna, you and I and the spirit whom you serve and command. To free Glacier and Maya, Brook and Hollow fell from Lohi's grasp. To bring the light and heat and force of the Aurelith to full fruition. Yes, yes, I think that's exactly it. We can drop the men off somewhere nearby and head north without wasting more time. When they're gone, we'll talk to the Aurelith spirit and find out what we're really capable of. Now that I've got all the shards together. You've 
done it. All the shards. You did what Anthea commanded you to do. And well. Now, uh, will you... Would you reconsider what you said earlier at home about going north instead? If Anthea got the shards, he would protect the capital and leave the rest of the land for Lohi to tear apart. I won't. I'm going to end the war by ending Lohi's reign. I have a mission. Not the one Anthea set me on, but a harder and more vital one. I won't falter. Then... Then that's my mission as well. I promise to protect you and the shards. And I will. I'm coming with you. <sighs> Thank you. I was hoping you'd say that. But I had no right to ask it of you. And I'm glad to know I have your loyalty. You're a funeral, old man. At least if you're lucky. Best hope they don't catch you alive. They'll bolt your hammer to your arm. What a ludicrous sight you'll be. Clanking around and taking orders from the North and us. You've done well, Lemmican. You got your vengeance. There's no need to die far from home when you have a home to go back to. Go find Ailing again and give your tribe a new generation. They'll remember you for centuries, I'm sure. Oh, shut your mouth. I'm coming along. If anyone's gonna dare the gates of North and face the Witch Queen, it should be me. Really? Thank you. You risk much, but I won't try to dissuade you. We've already made it this far. We'll go further yet, and end the war and come back home safe. Trust me, we'll finish this. We're heading north. Indeed, there's a project. Oh. The finest boat. I like how it's all smooth and ass, but these are dogs trapping the rain. <laughs> Wait, it's gonna end here, isn't it? This is the end. Fuck! God damn. Look at all these finished men. God damn. I guess they suspected the sequel, but I doubt that will happen, I say ass. Oh look, it's a Pekka. <laughs> I'll let you listen to the music.
long line of man cock. Cast them, fix them on. We did not, not yet. Oh look, it's young Hans, son of old Hans, or alt Hans. What the fuck? A production, baby. What the fuck? Oh, it isn't anymore? Oh no. Oh no, Manawi. I'll slap a vote on stream. That seems like the thing to do. If I could find the thing. There it is. We finished those on stream. I'm just setting up a vote. Give me a second.
Oh, there was something I was thinking of earlier that I could have asked. God damn it, what was it? God damn it, brain. Don't do me like this. I guess you're just getting these free because I can't ask.
Uh, looks like we're fisking. We fisking. Be our bait with fisk. I just left for fisk. <laughs>